Not to use curse words, though. Yeah, I was trying not to use any curse words. So. Son of a motherless goat! Son of a motherless goat. Son of a, son, son of a Balrog. Look, son of an undead Balrog. See? My splash page. Fantastic. I, I just threw that together the other day. It was good. Yeah. I even got a... Then a plot. If, if we need to... If we need to Yeah. Mephisto Red. Yeah, I gave you one, didn't I? No? Mephisto Red. Oh, I took the Mephisto. Evil Sons Scarlet. Yeah. Yeah, they are choices. Or maybe I can just use... Or you can use that. True Red. I like Mephisto Red. It's got an attachy name. And take it. It's, you it's, can bug out to it. Yeah, exactly. So, where all right. Where's your camera? Well, the camera's right there. Oh, it's pointing down. See? So we're gonna, yeah, look, there's Gabby's hands, guys. Ooh. Oh no, he didn't see his hands until now. Ooh. Now we see Gabby's hands. Nobody's watching us, but that's okay. I know. Nobody ever watched. Actually, the other day I had three people watching us. Let me get some water. I bought you one, didn't I? Mm -hmm. Did I? Mm hmm. You did. Oh. Okay. And I'm gonna drink it. Oh, frames are dropping. Oh no. That's all right. You, sir, are dropping frames. You ain't nothing but a frame dropper. You ain't nothing but a frame dropper. Crying all the time. Crying all the time. Let's see. I should probably do his teeth too, huh? Yeah, you want some whiteies? Or you want some uh, bone color for your wolf's teeth? That's probably a good idea. This is this is the unprofessional painting channel. Hey, some bone, off white, like dirty teeth, or well, yeah, I mean it's wolf teeth. It's gotta be dirty. Or you can like start with white and then like dirty. This is flesh, but it probably could pass. Oh, that's not bone white. Sure. No, it's not bone white. It's bone white. Do I have bone white? Is oh. that bone white there? Oh, that's right. This is bone white. Is that bone white? Yeah, this is Ush Usha Ushabti bone. Ushabti bone. Whoever that is, he's famous at his house. Alright. So they hear your neighbors too, huh? Yeah, everybody gets to hear everybody around here. That's great. That's great. Yeah. <laughs> Man, I am tired. But we're gonna paint. If you're tired, you don't wanna paint, you don't have to paint. It's too late. It's we're, too, you're here? We're here. You're here. We got here. My faithful fans want me to paint. Your faithful fans, all, all one or two of them. Oh, me, all one of them, apparently. Oh, we got one? I think that's me. Oh, oh. So. That's, I, not, that's I, not as useful. I, my faithful self, want you to paint. Want me to paint. If I remember correctly now, I was going to do the trim lines on this guy's armor. So. Let's see why we're dropping frames, dropping dimes, dropping dimes, working out the kinks on this thing. Not sure why. I don't see why we're dropping frames there. What? Anyhow. Look at that. I got the eyes in. You you painted the eyes in? Mm -hmm. You've painted more than me at this point. Yeah, we're there. Let's see, here you go. Put it on here. All right, guys. So this is this is uh, this yeah, is your frames are being dropped. That's right. You can see it over there. This is Gabby's wolf. The one and only. Well, you got like five of them, don't you? Four. Oh, oh, five of them right here. Five wolves. All basically all matte black and, and, and dry brush gray and then dry brushed white. Yeah, and look at all that detail. And then later, like months later, he can come back and paint an eyeball and some teeth. And he's got color on the, on the battlefield. And who's better than that? And that's, that's all that this is about, is having fun with your army. Meanwhile, I'm going to knock around this. Uh, it's just two guys jammed in a corner painting minis tonight. We should have done this on Saturday night.
I said that, but you were uh, what happened? occupied. Oh, I think I died Saturday night. Yeah, well, you came home and then you freaking died. I passed out. On, I did exactly what I said I would do. I turned on the TV and fell asleep on the couch. You told me you were going to sit hard on the couch. Well, deep couch deep sitting. Deep couch sitting. Is the, and I quote. Is the term. All right, so we got one set of eyes done. Next set of eyes coming. Just, I think it's noted, you have to note that on this channel it's been very frugal with what I do. And now, even more, I'm lending Gabby my water uh, cup. So we made a temporary water cup by cutting the bottom of your water bottle up. We're recycling, okay, folks. We're recycling because we love the planet. That's why we use water-based paints whenever we can. Before we run out of water with all this global warming, I probably should shake this up a little more, but I think I'm good. And I think this might be too thick of a brush. But let's see. Let's see how we. All right, guys. Oh, I didn't see the top of my head. And no. I'm gonna raise this up over here. Get some light in. Do it like that. It's the new set. I think it's the first time I paint with the new setup. Yeah, these wolves are for uh, Mordheim. Yeah. Before well, you were using them in Mordheim. By the way, Gabby, if you move me now, I will stab you with this brush. Okay. Just a heads up. No moving of the fur. Got it. Yep, I like that. I like that very much. This is what they would call in the motorcycle world pinstriping. I am pinstriping my mini. I like that. Huh. Alright, that's three down. Three eyes down? Yeah. I'm jealous. You're faster than I am. Um, I'm doing a dot, literally. A dot. Look at that. And this is a color that I didn't even think I was going to use on this guy because. I was already tired of painting green orcs. And I used this green on my orcs. So, which is why I got this other green to paint this guy. Originally, now you can see I have a giant dot of glob of paint on this brush that I'm using. But it's okay. Look at that. That's one thing I gotta get used to. What do you think? That's perfect. That's yeah, man. Good? Yeah. All right. We're doing great. Yeah, man. Me and my tree dots. Dude, I've said it on this on my channel here before. Don't worry about the quality. Make sure you're having fun and that it looks. You know. You gotta make do the best you can with what you got. But those actually look really fine. You will be fine, man. And now you got your three color minimum for when you go to the tournament. Are you going to the tournament? What tournament? I don't know. The tournament, tournament. When you go uh, play Age of Sigmar? These guys are for Age of Sigmar. Is it from Mordheim? It's from Mordheim. I can't play these guys in the same way I have another one. Oh, yeah? What army are they in? Uh, they are Norse. No, no, no. no. And, oh, this is the Chaos Marauders. They're uh, Slaves of Darkness, which is a Chaos. The wolves, the wolves are also? No, the wolves are Fenris. From, uh, Age of Sigmar? No, from 40k. Oh, they're not even Age of Sigmar? No. Wow, I never would have guessed that. Yeah, I bought them from, uh, Izzy, I think. I know that. No, not out of a box. I bought them from Izzy. They were his. Part of his, uh, 
are we? Space Wolves. They're from the Space Wolf Army. I had no idea the Space Wolves had actual wolves. They actually have wolves. As a matter of fact, uh, they're, one of their leaders rides around in a giant warg instead of a bike or whatever. He's in battle armor on a giant freaking wolf from hell. Nice. It's bigger than an orc, so I should tell you. And the orcs in that, that universe are friggin' gigantic. Are they orcs or wargs? No, the warg he rides on, it, on mm -hmm. is bigger than an orc. Which is like saying something. The orcs are fucking gigantic. Oh, it's yeah. saying something. No. <laughs> you watch Tup Tup Tup? No, not at all. Not at all. I'm going to put this guy over here. Now the question is, can I do the Tupas? I don't see why not. Because it's me. And I'm the king of not being able to paint very well. Well, that's not true. Those orcs, I mean, wolves are coming out pretty nice. Yeah. That's the perfect... Like, I get a lot of people that say that they don't know how to paint and they can't paint and it's just a matter of getting started and, and going. And the more you paint, the better you'll get. That's just it. I should find my first mini I ever painted because I still have it and show it next to the last mini I painted. And you'll see. The first mini I ever painted when I was like eight. When I got my elves in the mail from Ralph Partha. And I don't know why, but I'm pretty sure I, they came from England. I don't want to use this brush for this detail that I'm about to do. Because I'm pretty sure that I'm going to mess it up. But lucky for me, I have an even smaller brush. Just like the one I gave Gabby. I think this one will do the trick, but there's another one. I like it even better. Oh, was that it? No, that's not it. Yeah, I guess this is the one I'm using. Yeah. Yeah, my problem is at this hour, after the kind of day that I, I wanted to paint originally early this morning, but I woke up late. Because. Now at this time I am totally beat. Okay. Oh, I'm going to have to go back and touch that up. can't think right now. Oh, the teeth look good? Mm -hmm. Yeah. They look good. So the gloss? No. They don't really have gloss. You're, gonna, you're not going to paint his nails red? I don't even see nails red. His claws? Holy shit. I should get a dry brush and do the inside of the leg, though. Cause that shit looks bare naked. Language. Sorry. That's all right. At some point, I do want, I wouldn't mind if the people who watched me paint were younger kids. Do the children's? Yeah, I mean, you know. You want Sam to watch you paint? Is that what it is? I wouldn't mind. If he enjoys it. You would believe some kids. I just like watching people do this kind of stuff. I'm just saying. I 
That's just, oh, well, look at that, what happened to me. Too much water on the brush and total, total disaster just happened. Let's see if I can use a dry brush to suck that extra paint out. It worked. It worked. I think I want gooey paint to do this detail so that it doesn't run everywhere. Just like that. So a dry brush can take some paint off? So I had too much water in my brush and when I went to apply the paint, apparently it got to the point where there was water in the brush. And it ran all over the surface. So in order to suck up some of the excess paint, I just took one of my dry, the brushes that are dry here and lying on the table, and put it in the air and it sucked up the extra paint that I didn't want there. So it's a, there's a sneaky trick there for you for when... You have an accident. Alright. So there's that. Yeah, that's naked trick. Oh, I didn't show you how it was that I added the fin on that rocket for the uh, Space Marine. That Space Marine you were asking me about? That's from like 1980 something. You didn't tell me. You said it was cardboard. I did that. I did that on one of my last streams, which is pretty cool. I think I'm gonna add another wart to the back of this boot right there. I'm gonna have to wash them up a bit. Oh yeah, that's what I was gonna tell you when I saw the teeth. You could apply some Agrax to that, which is brown. And that might make the teeth pop and the spaces between the teeth darker, darker and recessed. So I think that would be cool. And then this particular thing here, I like that. Some touch up. That's kind of what I wanted to do originally. I think I'm going to do those fins on this helmet. That's a lot of paint. So Gabby, you have not watched my channel yet? I turned, tuned into it for about 10 seconds every day. And then you fell asleep? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I had to move on. Uh, oh yeah, uh, yeah, it's a long time. Three hours? Yeah, well, that could have been bad. I'm not sure this is what I want to do with this here, but... It is adding a little... more detail than what it had. Are you? Yeah. You having problems there? Oh, I see two more spots where I'm going to apply some of this green as a trim. It's a shame I didn't get any green wash from Ryan. But at some point I'm going to have to buy some. That's a little dry. Yeah, so that party I went to today was supposed to be over at 3. Ended at like 4. We stand, we stayed around talking for another couple of hours. Which was good. We had fun. Yeah. That's really cool. What are you doing? 
You can't just barge in here. No. <laughs> Let me see. Yeah. Yeah, man. That's great. When you put the wash, <laughs> you know, what are you doing? Trying to get it to show on the... Oh, there you go. There's your teeth. All right. The toothless. The toothless. Oh, you didn't paint his tongue. I don't know. I don't want to use my fist though for that. All right, it'll work out. All right, there's a lighter color red there. I'm thinking maybe flesh. Flesh color on the tongue? That's gonna look weird. But that, but that, the fist is gonna look popping like crazy. Blood red, yeah. Actually, I was just joking. I mean, if you were gonna do it, you should have done it before the teeth. You think? But you can always go back and paint over the teeth again. No. This is it. <laughs> All right. I'm not that invested. Anyway, this guy's done too. He's oh. the first. Alright, he's next. You two are done. How about you? Oh, you got, I'm sorry, I got three done. Apologies. Anyway, moving like a man. Are we ever going to play more to home again? That's, uh, I don't know. What are you playing then? I'm not playing anything. No, but what did you have? The, the I had night goblins. I had night goblins, and now I have uh, the, undead. the undead. I have a lot of undead. You have a good time. I have the undead that I painted last year, and then I have all the undead that I painted when I in the '80s that I I'm probably just gonna rebase them and seal them up. I'm not gonna repaint them. They're really worn down though, but they're undead so. Okay. They're painted with enamels. So. Oh, shit. What's the matter? Too much water, I think. Oh. Let's see if I can get another brush and paint some of it. So, I'm going to get some brass. This, this is the armor ghoul. Let's see what happens. Let's get this gold shaken up. With these metal paints, all the flex settle down at the bottom. Yeah, I could dry brush these teeth all together. Yeah. The question is how do I get the brand from the brush? Well, you get paint on the brush and then you like run it lightly over your skin or the paper towel till it just leaves a little. You know what, before I get that I just realized I missed a spot for the green. I missed a spot of green. So I'm going go in here. Look at that. That's a dry brush, quote unquote. Nice. these guys they're, they're using these giant paint brushes to do this stuff I can't I don't know not that I can't I guess I guess I need practice All right guys oh maybe if I paint it on screen you know what I think I'm going to do? You want screen? No, I'm going to change the camera angle. Not the angle, but the... Uh, Location? Yeah, just like that. Yeah, that works a lot better. Yeah, the biggest problem with me doing this on camera is that I'm nearsighted, so I'm super close to this mini all the time. Somebody was telling me I should probably get one of those giant magnifying glass lamps. Yeah. Maybe I'll try it in the future. But for now. 
in the year 2000. So if you put your minis on the back here. How's that? That looks great, man. I like the way these so that's that's a twenty-eight millimeter wolf, but it's the new twenty-eight millimeter. So look at the size compared to the twenty-eight millimeters from back in the day. Like, like he could technically ride that wolf. Well they're supposed to be as big as people. Well, there he is. But the old 28 millimeters are smaller because they, they call them hero. Okay, this is my <coughs> Right, this is 28 millimeter, but you stand him next to a new mini, an old mini, and that's the difference. Hero, big. Hero size 28 millimeter, which is bigger than 28 Baby millimeter. Dos. Yeah. But I'm, I'll put my money on my guy. He'll kick your guy's butt. That guy probably. Now this guy, this guy, I don't know. This guy, this guy painted, this know. guy painted at the shop. Well, some of it at the shop. I think we were playing a D&D &D game when I painted this guy. Right? I love the sword. Yeah, yeah. show him the sword. Yeah, the sword came out pretty nice. With the blue runes. I like it. Yeah. Keep a good looking guy. I like a blue eyes, blonde beard. Ready to kick Very ass. Ready to kick butt. I'm gonna try brass. Do I have brass? Cause yeah, here it is. I think brass is. I wonder if this would look like on the horns. This is brass and this is. What do you think? Gold. I'm gonna go with this one. What are you doing? This on the horns. I don't know. I can't see what you're painting. The bone. Oh, that would be fine. Well, what did you use the bone for before? The teeth. Yeah. Yeah, that should be fine. Well, yeah, I know, but he's already got white on there, so. On the horns? Yeah, see. I've you can do the points and change it up. Well, I, I painted some dry brush on that one. Yeah, it looks fine. Yeah, I shook up this metal paint really good. What is this? Uh, Baltazar Gold. Looks like a light brass to me, which I think will be good for the belt buckle on this guy. I get some paint off of this thing. So what'd you do this weekend, Gabby? Absolutely nothing. Nothing at all? Well, wait, weren't you at uh, Zach's house? No, dude. That was last week? Well, this weekend, he's, uh, the next two or three weeks, he's going to be doing all kinds of shit. Because it's his birthday, his anniversary, and then his wife's birthday. Oh, we fra, fra, fra. One right after the other. That's going to be terrible. Yeah. He says he gets in a lot of the way in shit. When he found out they had the same birthday and he was taking her seriously, he said, oh yeah, we're getting married in the same month, hopefully within the same week, or at least in the same area, because huh. it'll make life that much easier to remember and to deal with. I don't think that's, that was wise, but okay. Why not? They tend to get all mushed together. Right, and that's okay. Well, depends on his lady, I guess. He makes sure to get her a gift for her birthday and for their anniversary. He doesn't really give a shit if he gets one for his birthday or not. Yeah, well, that's typical, guys. Yeah, hey, welcome to us. Yeah. And most of the gifts we want don't cost money. Yeah, not at all. Mm -hmm. Just time. Not even a lot much time, really. Yeah, about a minute. <laughs> Good five, six minutes. You, 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 you made me a. Uh, you made me now make this sh uh, sheath have a, a copper end, so. Oh, well, I did that? Yeah. I touched it? Yeah, you moved it. Gosh. You no, I'll try my best not to. You move around so much. All right, so I've, let's see. What do they call it? I'm gonna go ahead and do that. When you, uh, Cut my teeth, yes. I've, figuratively speaking, and literally speaking, cut my teeth on these wolves. Yeah. 
And now I'm gonna see if I move on to the guys. And they have no idea what I'm gonna do. Well, you can follow. Well, you got the box here. You can either follow the box or follow the guys you've already painted. I don't but like the box. Then follow the guys you've painted. But the way you got them painted is fine because it, it's the color. Once you get them all with those base colors like that, you just slap on. Is that Mephisto red I have on? Uh, probably because we used my red and I only had Mephisto red at that time. I'm going to paint. Yeah, I gave you a bottle of lead belcher. And it's back with you. I didn't keep it. It's over there. Where? That's over there, probably. No. Mm -hmm. No, you do have it. Oh, well, here's my old one. Yeah. Use that. That's the one I was playing with. Oh. Yeah, I have a lead belcher. Stop it! Quit it! Quit the lead belching? Stop belching your lead at me. Well, the reason they call it lead belchers, they have some mini, right, that does something else? It's a 40k paint. I know, but there's like something that they use it on that... Lead belches lead? Or some, something to that effect, I think. It's leady? I don't know. And the like? I don't know. So I don't you know that I want to paint the straps with this one, do I? You know what, I usually... Should I stick with this one and keep painting straps with it? Or... If they're already got base color, I mean... It, I mean, I would go ahead and do a, uh, what do you call it, a production line? Yeah, but do I do it with this, is the question. It's up to you, man. That's the beauty of this. It's all whatever you want it to be. I want it to be over. Do you really? You just got here, man. I am not you. I do not get the enjoyment of the painting. <laughs> so you're you're forcing yourself to are you in pain right now? Is that what's happening? I'm not in pain. <laughs> Feels like it. <laughs> are you not happy right now? I wish you could I could be happy doing something else. Really? Well, you could pay Eric to do it. Why? God's being if I pay somebody to pay my minis. I never understood that shit. Really? Yes. Well, I don't know. I mean, if you, you don't enjoy painting minis, or you enjoy pay, playing, or you could do what I, what I did. You can paint your army one solid color, and then one day go in with another color and do them all. Add that. You know what I mean? So I'm going to go back now with this bright green and do some touch up on this guy because it's needed badly. Before I do that, I'm going to paint. some light green on I want to clean up Oops. that's interesting what? Uh, apparently this paint gets darker once it dries because I just put the same color over itself well, well that makes sense yeah And then this thing there you go I showed you about these craft paints I told me they were less expensive a dollar sixty They're just as good yet, but they yeah. don't suck. They work. Well, they don't suck. I'd have to say they're better than paying the exorbitant price that they want for the other ones. You know? 
Oh yeah. I would tend to agree with that wholeheartedly. So I know that needs to be like that. I should have fucking listened to you. How's that? In regards to the shield. What did I say about the shield? No fucking glue on the shield until you paint. Oh. Yeah, but then you you wouldn't have had shields for a, what a year. Yeah. So. Also, look what I did. I just messed up one paint while fixing another. It's great. I hate when that happens. I am definitely not in my optimum painting condition. I can tell you that. You know when you're tired and your eyes are like salty? You know what I mean? I guess. You know like your eyes are like stingy salty? No? I guess. Yeah, that's kind of where I'm at right now. Like the crappy lead belt track gave you because it was not working. I threw it out. You threw it out? Right. Your tiny lead belcher? Yeah. yeah, I threw it out and gave you that one twice already. You did it? To use that one. Why? I know, but... But what? You make it sound like you had two. Yeah, I have a brand new one that Ryan gave us. It's in there? Where? Oh, it's over there. Oh. I'm giving you the one that we already started and opened before. Okay. Why? Well, I, I was going to give it to you to have, and you said, don't give me any paint. So no, so, now, so now... I'm not worthy. So now I'm just giving you paint that you can use that I've already started using. Because I'm not going to open two bottles. Why do that? that? That just means that those colors that I have doubles of, except for Lead Belcher and maybe uh, the... Uh, I'm going to have those for a long, long time. There's guys on the Facebook group that I'm in that have had paints from the 80s that are still good. Where was that paint that I messed up? I can't find it. It must not be too obvious. Hey, I found that area I needed to retouch. Congrats. Well, I'm going to... Go, 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 go. You heard from the other guys? I so saw I saw one of the Eric's. One of the who? The Eric's, the one that can't read. Who can't read? The one that always says, "Oh, I can't read." You remember him? No, I do not. Yeah, he played forty two. Where'd you see him at? At uh, what's the thing, sir? Playing forty two. Oh, it's Zach's. Wait, so are you playing 40k or are you playing... Yeah, no? Yeah, you got that fucking game, are you crazy? It's expensive. That's an even bigger money pit than fucking Age of Sigmar. Huh? Hmm. So what did you do when you got there? Well, they were playing Sigmar, I wait. I mean, if they're playing Sigmar, I play. If they're playing uh, 40k, I either wait or leave. Or I just don't go. Usually we play uh, Elder Tour or something like that afterward. So, you know. Oh, is that a board game? Yep. Yeah. Okay. And not board as in, you know, I'm bored. Board as in a board game. Oh, I got you. I got you, man. Yeah, man. Yeah. I think uh, I'm done drawing on this guy. 
Wait, I know I, I missed a spot around here that I can't find. There it is. I haven't even looked at the chat, so I don't know if we're being watched or listened to or what. We got one viewer, probably yeah. still me. That's the yeah. It is Sunday. Is that you? Huh? Oh, it's Sunday, you said. Yeah. It is Sunday. It is Sunday. Sunday. It came out of your mouth. You understand? You're coming out of my mouth. I love that guy. My wife used to love that show, that movie. You still? I don't know if she still does. You know what? I'm going to touch up the back of these fins on his head because I can with this light green. So the guys online helped me identify this mini that I'm painting from back in the day. He's an anti-hero. Like anti-paladin? I would say. Something like that. And I've painted him this bright green, which is f deceiving, I guess, because bright green is a positive, happy color, I guess. Foresty, right? Oh, yeah. That's cool. But... It's a dragon. He's dragon themed, and the chromatic dragons are evil, right? Yes. So technically, he could be a bad guy. The chromatic dragons are evil, and the metallic and the metallic ones are good. Which I never, I never even realized that, or maybe I just forgot from oh so long ago. And I'm just now remembering. What color do I paint the teeth on this shield? I think teeth on a shield are a bad idea. Yeah, well, unless it's a dragon head. Well, they're facing him, so if he gets crushed into this thing. Oh, well, <laughs> It's not going to be good. Do you have that bone color there? Yes, I do. I see it. Dude, you moved. I'm kidding. I know I didn't move you. <laughs> I'm fine. But that probably would have been enough to set you off. Me. from where you were at oh man let's see let's, let's paint some teeth there you go that looks good this is too much So we're going to see if teeth there. Shit. What happened? You, you got painter's Tourette? I got it. I got it. You got, you got painter's Tourette? Yes, I do. That's me. Okay. Let's see here. You can hear my PC working extra hard to run all this stuff. The music? No, the music I put on my uh, little radio thing, but it's doing the video and the streaming, so. I find that running video intensive applications do tax the machine and cause it to heat up 
Wouldn't you agree, Mr. Technical Guy? Mr. Technical Guy. Hmm? Yes, that, that would be an accurate assessment. Yeah. I did not cause all that hot mess. What'd you do, man? You messed up your mini? I've got a lot of green paint on my uh, brush here. I need to kind of get rid of. Apparently my brush was a lot dirtier than I had thought it was. the one I gave you? No, I was using my, my area, well, I don't know that I would call it an area brush, but it's bigger than the one you gave me. I'm going to have to go back and put this back Oh, this is not, uh, coming, done, bitch. It's not coming clean. Language. Actually, I'm actually gonna, when I'm done, I always upload them to YouTube, so they're there forever. You are, you are kids, and kids, you're always gonna know somebody who's a potty mouth, and just because they're a potty mouth doesn't mean you should be. Yeah. Do as I say, not as I do. Well, do as I say, not as he, not as he does. there buddy I didn't realize how dirty I'd gotten this brush at this is these bristles and it's not really coming clean you want to soak it for a little while <coughs> right. do what to who now Soak it like that for a little bit because I think. Oh, well, I can clean this guy at least, right? Yeah. Yeah. So we clean these guys up. Take a look at this guy. I think I'm gonna put some wash on this guy. Watch. Yeah, I kind of wish I had some green wash, but and maybe I'll make my own green wash. But I don't. Oh, I don't want to use Agrax. That's brown on the green. It's not gonna look right. That's not for the lens. You think for the middle? You have better eyes than I do. Well, you gotta get out to the edges. Did I? Or no? No. But it's fine. But you gotta get. You probably gonna need another coat. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I'm gonna put black on the. Uh, no oil on this. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna well, go where am I missing the edges on it? You didn't get the whole pad. Where? His whole leg, shin guard and pads. Well, the back. No. Well, oh, the front. Where? You need a you need a magnifying glass. I'm serious. Yes, I know. You should invest in one. 
So what am I going to use on this guy? I'm going to use this Ooh, big guy right here. That. That's horrible. So this guy can go here. This guy can go here. We're going to go with brown. Because the brown will look blackish here. Yep. That actually worked. Surprised you haven't asked me about the music yet. What? Mm -hmm. You know, I used to play stuff like that, right? No, I did not know that. Got it. It was a classical thing, kind of. Six years of piano. I took four years and hated every minute of it. I loved it. I asked for it, actually. I demanded it from my parents. Okay. Well, your parents would actually do what you asked them. My parents, they asked me what instrument I would like to play, and I said the guitar. So they made me take three years or, or four years of piano. What kind of money is going to be guitars? I don't know. That's what they said. Oh. Apparently. Well, I think I've messed up the wash on the shield. Well, I guess it'll come watch. When you add a wash and it dries, it makes a layer of color. So when you go back and add another wash to it, it's like but I had planned on making this a darker gray so that actually works out. Okay, and then on the back side of this shield, I just want it to be darker all around because it's the back side of the shield. What? You got a phone call? Was it a phone call or a text? That's mine. It's not mine. I think I, I think I've had my phone on silence all day, which, by the way, is why I didn't answer your call before. Whatever, dude. Well, I mean, I had people calling me today on Sunday. That you don't want to talk. To. From 8 a.m. I didn't call you at 8. I didn't yeah. text you at 8. I'm gonna yeah, that at 8. Well, once, once I got like three calls at 8 a.m. that I did not want to receive originally. I went ahead and silenced my phone, for, and then I just left it on silence for the rest of the day. I was not having it. And I was not happy about getting those calls so early on. The, on a Sunday? On a Sunday. Sunday morning. Usually I... Four? No. No. Where's your mom? People in my family that I refuse to mention on video. But yeah. Yeah, it was terrible. You're sitting here trying to be asleep and shit. Well, I hadn't slept well the whole night, and then finally, at 5 a.m., I was able to get... Like, I was dreaming and sleeping well, and it was nice. And then, of course, at 8 o'clock, boom. And the calls started. All the calls started. And not just my, my... Not even just my mom. There was other people calling me in the family. People need a ride? No. We had the family event today, and I already know that they were calling me to see if I'm going to go. And I'm like, look, I said I was going to go. Why would you call me again? They made a call on Sunday. Right. So I started the day a little upset. I'm sorry. To say the least. I'm gonna. I'm painting these wash up because I want it to be dark on the bottom and let the light kind of keep the the lighter portions brighter. Trying to keep the lighter portions lighter on the top. I mean, so from the bottom up. I'm painting my wash from the bottom up to try to get that effect. I did not. 
undercoat this guy black to white like I probably should have so Yeah, I'm do that. I'm do that. That's right. I'm gonna do that. Well, unlike all these other skeletons I've been painting for so long, this guy actually cleans his weapon. So that was nice, nice change to what I've been painting for the last bit. Well, that's not true. Actually, I'm happy I'm painting this guy because I've been painting the Space Works and the uh, Marines. Those, uh, the old ones? what do you call them? The uh, Rogue Trader era? Chaos Warriors? The, uh, well, the Chaos Warriors. Chaos Marines. Actually. The Chaos Warriors is the correct term that you had, yes. And the, uh, what are they called? The, the guys that I painted, painted gray. You know, you know what I'm talking about? The humans. Oh, the, the, the Rogue Trader uh, the, 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 the Imperial Guard. Are they Imperial Guard? Is that what they Yeah. So I was already getting tired of space stuff, and so. Oh, you're walking with big money, guys. <laughs> I'm almost well. I was almost done with my stuff, and now. Now I got you a whole bunch of marines. You got me, you got me a whole bunch of stuff. Well, they're sigmarines. <laughs> what did you give? They, those are. Those are the spellcasts. Right. They're not. Which are sigmarines. They're not 40k though. No, but they're sigmarines. What do you mean? Oh, they make fun of them, saying that they're sigmarines. Oh, why? Because they have three up saves. Everybody, or almost everybody, has a three up save, just like a space marine. Oh. Uh, all of them have ranged weaponry. Almost all of them. Do have they? Range yeah, it's half, half, half. If not, let's put it this way: sixty-six percent of all Stormcast Eternals have a ranged component. But Some of them have bolt guns. Nice. Which are even named the same, or something similar. I think it's either bolt, bolt pistols, or uh, bolter pistol is the, the the space marine one, and the other one is a bolt pistol, because it's literally a hand crossbow. Right. A monster hand crossbow, but a hand crossbow nonetheless. I don't know how the hell I'm gonna get in there to do this one. Turn. I don't know what you're looking at. There's one strap. that I needed to paint red that is on his on the same sh that's going up his chest on the same side as the axe take a look at it in his chest oh yeah I can't fucking get to that you could get there. Yeah, yeah, yeah but hold on I can't stop now on the mid mid, mid uh I'm gonna end up painting mid wash here or painting the axe in here. yeah but then you go back and clean it up yeah, I don't paint the axe if you haven't painted the axe out, then what's the problem? You're good. Okay, I think I'm going to leave that alone. Excuse me, guys. Public subs are great. That looks like ass, what I did. Absolutely. Give me a moment. I gotta paint his taint. You gotta paint his taint? I just did. You painted his taint. I did. Yeah, dude, you do the rest of them. You've done me good. You go for fudge buckets, man. Alright, so where's the guy? Let me see if I can get a black out of this thing. Paint this this large. Which one? Yours? Use the one I gave you. You didn't give me black. I did. No. You didn't give me black. This is lead belt. I gave you an Abaddon black. Oh, you put it back? I just never took it. Because the one I have is not Abaddon black. Okay. It's a prime. I think it's, it's going to work the same. 
I'm glad I used the brown wash on this. I want to get some wash underneath this here. I get it really dark in here. Under these giant shoulder pads. You don't know what giant shoulder pads are, bro. Dude, this guy's got. You gotta look at these. This guy is like right out of the 80s. Dude, have you seen the shoulder pads on these guys? And I think. Seen. Yeah, my black is shot. So, you just want to have it on black and stop crying. Different. You have that You're not gonna tell the difference. Where's your garbage? Bye. You got it. We're headed our own. Yeah, I think. Uh, yeah, that that gives them the weathered look. I like it. Let me see. Whoops. There you go. I don't know. I kind of like it. Mm -hmm. You did it on the leg and the arm? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they look Actually, different. I got it. Which one, what, what looks different? They look different than the other green that doesn't have the wash. Everything, green everything. was all the same in green, right? Yeah. yeah. Except for the wash. So now you've oh, no. differentiated the... No, the arms and legs, I used a different green. Oh, okay. But I've added wash now, so it kind of highlights... It doesn't pop out. The it, it's not us. Right. I know what you mean. Yeah, which is what I wanted. I knew it was a bright green, but once I added the wash, I knew that he was going to calm down. Calm down. And then calm I want to add some wash to the bottom of this, the bottom half of this shell, this shield, only to make it so that the bottom is dark and the top is light. Your black is jacked. It's jacked? You gotta shake it, man. I shook it. It's Give bad me. that it's jacked. I can't open the damn thing. Oh. No, uh, I'm afraid I'm gonna make a gigantic mess. There you go. Yeah, right. It's just closed properly. No, it's closed with pink seal on it. That's the problem. I don't know if you can get a good look at what this guy looks like now, guys. But uh, I like it. So I'm gonna take a minute to it's let this go. Roll. But I like it. Trying to paint finely with this, and that ain't gonna work. There we go. That's kind of what I wanted. It's a little more than what I wanted, but only because I want that there like that. This is fine. Well, I think this figure is done except for maybe. I need the flesh color in. I don't know where I'm going to highlight the flesh color? Yeah. You must have used what I had. Well, I've got a bunch of flesh tones that I know I didn't have before. I think I had. This love flesh is what I was using before. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's really white. But if you want to make them different color guys. No, I gotta go over his arm. If you want some ethnicity. 
I gotta go over his arm, which has silver on it because I botched the paint on oh. it. And now uh, there's probably some blood on it too. I think for you, the best thing is to uh, yeah, let me see this. Relax on the precision. To block the colors in, and not so much try to get the detail that you're talking about, because you can't see that well. Because the cool thing about your army is the way you've got them painted, when you see them on the table, they still look like a horde of, especially a, a horde of sociopaths. A sociopath, <laughs> yes. Precisely. Yeah, it's not like I was looking for it anymore. <laughs> exactly. And I knew this. I need to let this guy just dry. Stop putzing around with him. So that's about to happen. I'll take this guy, go like this, if we can get it to a point again. This, I'm not really impressed with the Citadel brush. I forgot who gave this to me. Not me, probably. But, uh, it's not my number one pick. Oh, I wonder what happens if I take this guy. This is a white. This is a really light metal. Rune Fang steel is like silver almost. Look at that. Holy shit. And I'm going to use it. I don't think this one's ever been opened. This is one of the ones Ryan gave me. Runefang? Runefang steel is almost a silver. What's this compound? I gotta study up now on what these compounds are. Preparation H? No, it's a compound paint. This one's never been open either. This is like, doesn't seem to be a, a paint. Either that or it's... Yeah, this is the... This is exactly what I think it is. Yeah, I think I like this. So if I take this, all right, there's, there's a little axe here. That's what I don't like about this brush. see how that would be useful in a bigger area. Whoop! Oh, I hate when that happens. Can I give you back the, the bump? Yeah, you need it. Yeah, you need it? I'm already done with it. There you go. Whoa! Alright. Let's clean this guy up. So that compound is like super dry brush type stuff, which I kind of used on my axe because I want his axe to have a little bit of oomph to it. And then I was I thinking, try? you keep you're just gonna keep burping on my stream, aren't you? Pretty much, yeah. You you're uh, you're, you're just terrible. I'm terrible. I actually hung this K 
kit for this thing in the water to see if I clear up some of the paint in it. And I think it did. Black is beautiful, man. Black is back. Back again. Shady's back. Uh, oh, I missed a spot there, but I think how the hell did I, get red there? I can put this guy here. Seriously, how the hell did I do that? I gotta pop this little bubble of paint with this. Let's go, bro. What'd you do, man? I got red somewhere. I have no business being. <laughs> so basically, you just basically you learn with trial and error, man. And the more you do it, like I said, the better you're gonna get. Obviously, you know already you need. You're going to need to invest in a, one of those uh, magnifiers. Magnifier lamps. Yeah. Which I think I myself should get. You're going to have a perfect book. Well, that'd be perfect for this, maybe. to go back with that other green that I did not want to go back with. This is not going to be pretty. Leave that there because I'm going to use that in a minute. Unintended highlights, but there they are. I already found that. I don't think I get. I don't know. You guys say that I put a lot of detail in my minis, but I don't know that I do. I see these guys on the internet. Those guys really detail their minis. But I do try to get them to a level that I like to have them at. That's for sure. I think this thing needs to be pronounced. This little dragon on his forehead needs to pop. So now that I've done spot there, paint that last ridge there, I think that's cool, I'm going to take this all the way down, 
Take this to here. Get rid of that crud that I just was looking. This guy is done. I gotta do his base now. So I want a dark brown for the dirt. I'm gonna put some flock on it, but first I'm gonna have to seal it. So I'm gonna take this guy. I'm gonna take off my headlamp. You would think that I did not need a headlamp with all these lamps that I have here. No, I could use a headlamp. But I could, huh? I could use a headlamp. I use it. I actually have two of them. You think it'll help you? Go ahead. I'm gonna press the button twice because the first lamp, the first light that comes on is red. I wouldn't even know what that button is. Top of it. I think you have it upside down. Oh yeah, there you go. Swing out. Yes. If you jam your finger between the. I find that that setting is the perfect setting. All right, so then for the base, I got that white around his feet. I'm gonna go with a dark brown, and I've got a new brown. I've got a Doom Bull brown, which I think is what I've always used, but I saw. Rhinox hide, which is even darker. So we're gonna go with some Rhinox hide in the base around his feet. Is that helping you? But this is a oh yeah, this is gonna work. Almost black. I like it. Where has this brown been all my life? Oh, Ryan had it. In this case, I don't care if I load up the brush so much because I'm this part of the uh, mini. This material sucks up a lot of paint and liquid, so I don't need it. And I don't care. Like if I dry brush, leave the black, and then dry brush this brown over it without trying to get it on. The rest of the mini, that's going to be a bonus for me. Get this guy over here. Get this guy over here. Alright guys, so I'm just going to clean my brush on this texture. While I try and cover the exposed white and the baking soda that I used as material for the base and then whatever's left on the brush I'll take it and wipe it off here which will keep a black bottom with a brown top All right. Yeah, I could tell the difference when I'm not using the uh, headlamp, that's for sure. 
That's all right. I got lights all over. Okay, I got this guy here. I can tell my eyes are are tired. to get paint on his shoes but I really want to cover the exposed baking soda around his feet now this mini is an old school mini that used to have or still has a metal base that it came on I think some people cut them off to do to base on to base on new bases yeah. but I don't uh, I don't know, something keeps something I want to keep the mini intact as it came in the box, but I still want to be able to use them in the modern setting. Yeah. So that's why you see some of these guys are just glued onto a, on a plastic base over under the metal one. Yeah, which is what I've done. But then I bury the metal one under the baking soda to give it this this texture. I picked up the baking soda technique from from the one of the one of the guys I follow on YouTube, his name is um, his the name of his channel is uh, Tabletop Minions, and he he there's a crack he uses super glue and baking soda which has a uh, chemical reaction with each other, and makes for an interesting base, but in this case I just use Elmer's glue, and. Uh, And kind of made a, a paste with the Elmer's glue and the baking soda and that's what this is so this is really a, just a mountain of Elmer's glue well actually it's Elmer's glue brushed on maybe I put some green stuff under here I don't even remember which in the future I'd be using Milliput but I didn't have Milliput so I'm just using green stuff because I have it. And that's just what I do. Use what I got. Right? Use what you got. Huh? I think it pretty good. I think you did too from what I've seen. So now he's got this mud color base which is nasty. But that's a good base for well I'm gonna put I'm gonna probably dry brush some green on it and then I'm probably gonna glue some actual gla grass on it but before I glue any base stuff on it I'm gonna have to uh, seal this guy with sealer where is my sealer oh, there it is I got satin and gloss I got uh, a light brown could be this guy this guy needs to dry this is going to take a minute to dry I think I'm just excited that this guy's almost done. He has not, he's been sitting in a box unpainted for 30 years. So the fact that he's this yeah. close to being finished is like a miracle. So I had this guy with. I'm going back over this. What's up, son? Those are your friends outside making a racket? No. No. Those are the neighbor's kids. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
That's right. This particular stream has been very productive. Productive, yeah. I think so. I'll take one. I'm fine, but thank you for offering this. Okay, you want to check out the uh, anti-hero? No. Here. Industry. I'll take a Hawaiian roll. Yeah. Yeah. But you see, we finish his base. What's up? The light was messing up. That's dope. I came out a lot better than I thought he would. Come on. Is this cool? Mm -hmm. He's got a tiny little eye on the max. Oh yeah. That was in there. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Well now you doing ASMR? I am. Eating I'm, e I'm eating into the mic. What does ASMR stand for? ASMR? Uh, oh. silly music? Oh. Really? ASMR, silly music, really. Oh, awesome. Where's my water? Don't throw it at me, please. I need some water. <laughs> uh, don't throw it at I'm me, please. I'm actually still... <laughs> Have you met any of uh, your buddies are online now with you or no? Joaquin? I'm not playing Oh. Yeah, I think I'm near finished here for the night. But let me get this guy over here. Oh, this needs some more. So I touched one of these up. So I think they're ready for washes. What do you think? Take a look. <coughs> Let me close this up. Yeah, Actually, I'm going to do this. Boom. Oh, I still have to do something. I love Belgium. Um, you're going to crush your mini with your butt. Oh, wow. It's a nice butt. Yeah, well, Let's see. You can take a smoking break. So, yeah, I think that once you throw a wash on this guy, it'll do a lot of the... Well, he needs still... Silver studs on the handle to the axe. Yeah. And okay. I think that's it. Okay. And no? that was it. It's it's all up to you. And the face. Yeah. But yeah. I guess the wash will help the face. You're gonna see when you get that magnifying glass, you will benefit greatly from it. Maybe if I did that. I keep moving my camera angle so people can that's see what. And I, I gotta do the wa the black on the. Yeah. Uh, yeah. The but in this case, I mean, like I said, for tabletop, this is fine. Yeah. The other guy. And once you throw. This guy's a little bit more detailed, I think. I have to repaint the helmet a little bit after I walk. I okay. put some of the. But the yes, you're right. This guy is a lot more detailed than him. So whatever you did for doing this guy, you need to apply for your other guys. So. Yeah, I gotta put the studs on the, on the skirt. And the weapon, and so, then I can so don't water and down. also the stud when, on the, when you on go the brace. To, when you go to do the studs, don't water down the paint. No, just drop. Just, just drop. and then that way you can just do like that, and it'll it'll yeah, yeah dab it right on. Yeah. And your Viking. That's why I did the eyes. I didn't brush out this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And your your Viking hordes will will look good. Will be terrifying somebody. That's right. Kill you. That was my, uh, my... Your French Viking horns? I kill you. Yeah. Isn't that what the guy said in uh, Monty Python? No. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Alright, so then this brown looks like it's dried a lot. I think I'm going to add another brown to it. Before I go, and there's a white spot in there that I cannot let go. So this brown is a lot goopier. Let's 
So, let me see something. Yeah, see? A lot of texture there. From these black, dark brown, and now this red brown. Makes for a lot of texture. See that? Oh. I'm not too worried about that because. I'm going to put some flock on here, some grass, because I want this guy to be from a forested area, the likes of which he probably defeated that green dragon that he's wearing. Granted, I don't know, how big was that dragon, because he's Got his head on the shield, so it couldn't be that big. It's more like a fire breathing gator, not a fire breathing dragon, but he got him, so he's gonna wear him. I think that's good for now. I will wait for a dry day and seal them up before I apply some grass let me see and that's it for today guys next time we I come online I will apply the grass and one of those new shrubs I got and do the rim of the base and he will be done so yeah thanks a lot and have a good night